Hi everyone, this is Kathy. Welcome to my channel, Kathy Mamelin Psychic Medium. Welcome to the next 72 hours, the general reading for all signs. Whoever found this message, it's meant to be heard. So whatever sign you are, if you found this message, there's probably a reason you were drawn to this. So let's see what Spirit has for you. Spirit, please share with me any messages of guidance, what's going on around us. Next 72 hours, please. What do you need us to, to hear? I'm listening for you now. Stars in the sky, limitless possibility. Oh, I love the bridge. I love the energy coming in. I love this feeling of connected to the universe. The light is shining. So a sense of limited less possibility. We need to know that. We need to know that whatever obstacles, challenges come our way, that we have the ability to overcome them, right? We, we can do it. So they're pushing you, straddling worlds, wandering between the realms, understanding that you're not in control just came into me, understanding that spirit is in control, that you know, you can only do so much here in the material world, but then you have to surrender. And then I have a lost compass, getting back to integrity, getting back to your inner compass. Where is your inner compass guiding you? What is it that spirit has for you? You have to learn to let go, let go of the things that you can't control and control the things that you can. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome to anybody that's new Please remember to hit that like button. Thank you for your comments. Spirit, tell me about my limitless possibilities coming my way. I have a temperance. I have a page of cups. I have a king of wands. And I have a justice. Came into me as um, I want to put I, I want to put the energy into somebody else. Um, I want to put the energy into other people. I should say it doesn't even mean to one person. I just want to be treated fairly, whether it's in work or relationships, or I don't want somebody to take advantage of me. Um, I want more balance. You know, that that's coming into me more, more balance in your life, that that's something that you're struggling with. Um, you know, like either somebody's, you know, you feel like you're being pulled in a thousand different directions or that uh, somebody could be taking advantage of you in some way because of your kindness of your heart. Um, so you want to be treated more fairly. So putting boundaries around yourself would be probably the best things to do. Saying no to somebody that, um, you know, is taking advantage of your hard work, your effort, uh, something like that. You know, the person who always says, you know, can you help me with something? And then they never help you when it's their time that you need help. Um, I want you to focus right now on your success. I, I, it is coming into me as success. Um, because I have that hard work and I have this um, six, of, six of wands and I have this um, six of wands and eight of pentacles. So your hard work is paying off something along those lines. But I want you to focus on your own success just for a moment, just even in the next couple of days, you know, just like kind of buckle down at work, buckle down at, you know, where am I putting my focus? Where am I putting my energy? Because I do feel like success is, is um, on its way. I don't want you to be pulled in a direction of there's somebody out there that has a tendency to take you off off task. Like what they want you to do is more important than what you need to get done. So try to focus on what you need to get done. If you have a list of priorities, I want you to work on those priorities. Let's get some messages about this success for a moment, because I feel like that is the message today. Let's see. I have make it work. You have all the tools you need to succeed. But you have to put in the effort. You excel at working with your hands and fixing problems. You have to make it work, right? If you, you're pulled in a thousand different directions, you have a schedule that you need to meet, you make a big list in the beginning of your day of all the things that you need to get done and somebody pulls you away from that list so you don't get done what you wanna get done. So that's the boundaries, that's kind of setting up your schedule so that you can succeed. Um, is it putting yourself first? Yes, in a sense. I mean, obviously you have priorities and obviously we have obligations. But I'm talking about somebody who could be, um, I, I don't know, taking advantage of your kindness. I want to say it that way. 
rewards. You are cashing in and all the good work you've done. There could be a raise coming. Keep going. Keep growing. Get ready for this treasure chest. Guidance. Divine forces are showing you the way to go. You are discovering another piece of your destiny and your life purpose. They had said in the beginning that it was a combination of what you can control here on earth and then what the divine is controlling. You need to look at that. Um, it's okay to look for better work, be discreet. You need to be aligned with your life purpose. If you feel like you're just not where you want to be, something like that, you know, obviously you can, you can make a change. Let's get a couple more of these. I feel like the spirit, spirit is guiding you. Uh, unknown forces are driving the situation. You may not be able to control the outcome. The cycle will shift soon and you will be okay. So this feeling of being okay, letting go, surrendering, um, putting boundaries around yourself, not being pulled in a thousand direct, different directions because you can't get anything done. And then one more, I have an offering. You will be offered a new position or investment opportunity. Think about it, research it. Um, so there could be something new coming. I want to just go back to this because you're, I feel like your hard work is paying off. You know, it's just, a. Um, I feel like you're being pulled, you know, for those of you that just feel like I just get pulled in a thousand different directions. Sometimes we have to surrender to, we're not in control. We have what control what you can control and let go of what you can't control is the message today. Okay. Work hard at what you can do. Set your priorities, put your time and effort into, into you and those priorities so that you can reach these, this level of success and achievement that spirits letting you know that, um, what did they say in the beginning that you have uh, limitless possibility, limitless possibility of success is yours but you have to control the energy and you have to control uh, your time. So I feel like, you know, balance is important. That was an important message today. So just for the next couple of days, I want you to focus on you and I want you to, um, you know, make sure that you're, you're putting effort into an area of your life that you do have control over. And if you don't have control over it, let it go and ask spirit for the guidance, of course. So let's end with a um, angel message. Let's just see what your angel number is today. Spirit, please share with me an angel message. 222. <laughs> I am balanced. They're trying to give you balance. Trust that the seeds of your thoughts are growing as you are nourishing them with words, feelings, and actions. Your actions matter. Where you put your effort in, your hard work paying off, looking for more balance. Surrender to the things that you can't control and focus on the things that you can today. I want to thank Spirit for these messages. If you're new to my channel, please remember to hit that like and subscribe button. Um, comment below, claim it, own it, it's yours. If anyone would like to book a private reading with me, check out my website, kathymamelinpsychicmedium.com.